you guys and welcome to the channel if you're new don't be you guys and welcome to the channel if you're new don't be go ahead and click that subscribe button to be part of the witness gang to join the witness nation now let's get into this shall we hope you guys can hear me <laughs> can you hear up all right i see you guys coming in welcome 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 thank you thank you mary thank you for that connection i'm about to log out okay okay that that's fine sean you guys can hear me okay give me a thumbs up Okay, my husband got, got his phone on, so you guys can hear me just fine. Oh, I'm looking good. <laughs> that light on point. Y'all get ready because I'm going to be coming to y'all live in full effect, okay? So welcome, you guys. We are in 2021. Eh, 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 eh. Now, I'm just letting y'all know now I got my husband jacket behind me, baby. Okay, I don't have to mess up the inside, blah, like for real, because you know it's a little toasty out here in these streets. Hey, everybody! Hey, Team Truth! Hey, hashtag O C O V! Hey, y'all! Okay, welcome! Oh, we got oh, y'all are coming in here. Okay, y'all are ready. All right. Well, as you guys may or may not know, I am Whitney D. I am your host. Just to give you guys some house rules. My main thing is what? Say it with me now. Keep it cute or get the boo. Meaning, respect my platform. I'm not saying that you have to agree with me, okay? But I'm saying for you to be able to articulate your feelings and emotions accordingly, okay? We're grown. If we're not, I don't know why you're on my channel if you're a kid, okay? Go on, go on and play with some Legos or something, all right? It's this ain't for you, okay? But not for nothing. You guys are in for a treat on tonight. It's I I I mean I I don't know about any any of this. Like I told you know um, Sean when I was uh, talking to her, um, I'm not in these YouTube streets like that. Y'all know I'm not because you know the Lord is still working on me. I'll pull up, okay? So um, you know not for nothing. Um, you know I guess some stuff done went down. Um, but we're going to clear the air here because Whitney DTV is very neutral here. It's very safe. Um, you know, like I said, just the ground rules to keep it cute or you will get the boot. And it goes for the uh, um, the uh, guests that are joining us. Now, I just give you guys a precursor. My husband is over here warming me up. OK, so if you hear him, ignore. OK, because I need to be toasty. OK, he's trying to make sure I say cute. Thank you, baby. Thank you. Yeah, love him. Okay, you guys. So, um, let's get into this. All right, all right. So, Team Truth. Okay, this is a missionary statement. Okay, um, bridging the community communication gap between positive authority figures and minors, taking the power of silence away from those whose intent is to do our children harm. Joining us tonight is uh, the president and co-founder of Team Truth LLC. Yeah, let's go on and get this established, okay? It, it, it's, it's different entities when it comes to Team Truth. I myself, as you guys know, I'm not a part of no Team Truth LLC. I'm not a part of these little gang groups. I'm not a part of that. I just look for the truth, period. And I told you guys that whatever that may be. Now, I've made some friends along the way, and I love y'all. They love me. But I also had the rough side of that um, whole affiliation, too. Okay? And with that being said, we are also going to be bringing on another guest. Um, you guys may know her. I did not. I had to do my research, okay? But not for nothing, she experienced the other side of um, that as well, okay? And causing her and this young lady, Sean, the president, to clash, okay? So we're going to try our best to see if they can reconcile. But we have to do what I always, I'm big on it, y'all know. Say it with me now. Start with A accountability yeah holds you behind accountable for what you do okay and so it's gonna be nice and clean um but before we begin i need you guys to take out this time to like this video 
Okay, because I see how many people up in there. I need to see it even out. Okay, and then also I need you guys to go ahead and share this video. It's going to be spicy. Okay, it's going to be spicy. All right. Now, um, I'm not sure if we're going to have Mr. Angelo with us tonight. Hopefully. Okay. Um, you know, but moderators, make sure you guys are checking the chat um, because, you know, I'm not with the tonight okay i'm not all right so uh let's go ahead and get into this the um first person that i'm bringing on as you guys know is the president and co-founder of team truth llc sean busby okay and i'm gonna bring her on here you guys we're gonna take a little intermission okay i know this is getting good so what i'm trying to do now is get the president back and Angelo back. You guys don't want to miss this. Okay. So keep, keep near. Okay. This is a good time. Uh, now y'all see what Whitney DTV is going to be about in 2021. Okay. So take out the time to become a member. I am taking members or go ahead and subscribe, go ahead and share, go get you some popcorn and come on back. Okay. I'm about to play some mercers and pay some bills and we'll be back. Okay. All right, you guys. Come on in people. All right, you guys, that was a real quick break because we got Angelo on here, okay? <laughs> I'm about to bring him on. We're still in the process of getting uh, Sean on. So let's go. Let's welcome Angelo. Hey, yeah, you found the link, didn't you? Ah. Can y'all hear me? Yes, we can hear you. What's going on? Nothing much. Uh, Sheena is in the chat. Sheena, you're more than welcome to come back on. I just because... want to address. Uh, I just want to um say something to. Him. I'm gonna be quick. Okay. I, I I wasn't here for. I I missed probably the majority of the live, but I did come in every now and then that I was in a good area to um shoot a message. But oh no, the whole cold chat. I heard Sean did a. A uh, 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 outstanding job at explaining a lot of things. Um, I'm not sure how hard she went, but I wonder is Sheena back on here? No, uh, Sheena left. Okay, so even listen. if she's on, she's uh, right, so in listen. the chat. Well, well, this, 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 the, this, the both of them, right? Let's team, team truth, even with Sean, right? Sean is, has been a blessing to team truth. Ever since I, I uh, decided to uh, go over and bring Team Truth as a company to do bigger and better things, it is something that, that weighed on my heart and something that she helped guide me to, being as though she was a very, very, very sport, spiritual uh, woman, just like um, a lot of people kind of, I'm going to say Christian woman, because she, 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 she carries herself in every way, just trying to be as humble and helpful mm -hmm. as she possibly can be to anybody. But she do got a little snappy side now. Don't get a fool. So, uh, um, you know, what I wanted everybody to understand, I seen some of the chats. I, I caught here and there where people was looking for so much and, and, and so, so, so much for Sean to get on there and just release all this uh, bad stuff about it. The, the key is going back to what people don't understand. It's a Team Truth and it's a Team Truth LLC. And I'm explaining it to you better. Larry is outstanding at what he did for us beginning work, groundwork with me, getting to Team Truth to take off. And then he took YouTube and he turned into a whole new world. That was still Team Truth. That's why when people couldn't get to me, they would get to him. It's nothing, nothing different from that. But the difference is, Larry is the one that's unfiltered. So when you throw a rock, he gonna throw a brick. 
Sean, on the other hand, represents Team Truth LLC. You throw a rock, we're going to find a solution or build a wall so the rock don't hit or, or cross or, or be able to hit nobody in the head no more. We're not going to throw bricks back. We understand that the problem was in yourself. Why you threw the rock in the first place? Our job is to try to find you an outlet to bring out that anger in a different way where it's not violent. So for those that try to tune in and ask questions and ridiculous questions about, they thought it was about Sean coming on here. I don't understand why so many grown adults don't understand what a business is and what this freedom of speech on a YouTube channel is. It's different. It's a difference when you go on here and you battle somebody and you're going back and forth for the truth. And it's a it's a big difference from somebody that has a business and you obtain so many people personal um, stories and, and personal uh, situations that they've been through and tragedies that they've been through in their life. And somebody sitting there biting their nails worried about if their secret will come out on Team Truth for this and that. So that's one of the main reasons we had started separating some of the some of the dialogue because I didn't want people to feel like oh I told my story you know and they might they might say something about me or about uh, what I told them we don't do that Shana um I I, I I met you briefly I did what I did out the kindness of my heart but I did, really did it because Sean was in a, a situation where she she gave me a request to do and and I just followed through as she would follow through for me the same way Larry will follow through to, for me if there's something on that end. It's no different. You didn't do anything wrong by reaching out to, to Larry. You didn't do anything wrong by reaching out to Team Truth. I couldn't get in the logistics of why you was on um, the internet saying my name pretty because all I did was bless you and kept it moving. I didn't never repeat what I did. I didn't have to. I could have put up receipts. I could have put up the, the my my team truth account i could have sent the pictures you you already know you could have gave you the dialogue the text I, I don't do that because at the end of the day sean expressed to me that you were a victim so if i did that then you posed to go on the internet and bash me but being as though i didn't do that you should never have done that you um, done anything to say team truth llc this and that you went at us hard and I never paid attention to it because you have a deep pain. Sean, I think obligation is trying to connect to the world. And, and she tried to connect to so many people through this. She opened up her own scars, her own wound, and wound up getting herself sick. What a lot of people didn't know. You know, as we all will, when we take on a bunch of illness, when we take on a bunch of sickness, once we take on a bunch of everything that's not good, you're going to wind up having to pay for it as well as myself you know i wind up having to take a break for a minute because of health reasons nobody know about it you know i'm strong as a bull in one aspect but I had to had to get the help of some professionals on another aspect because if you live in the cesspool of this 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 mess right here you're gonna wind up losing who you are and you're gonna stop taking care of yourself you're gonna stop taking care of your family as much as you did you're gonna lose something with yourself to be a part of this cesspool. That's just the devil's work. That's how the devil works. He ain't giving you nothing for free. You're always losing something. So my point of coming on here was for Sheena and to Sean. Sean, I might have to look back in because I don't know how much, what, how, um, what all you spoke about. And I wanted to clear some other things up and I ain't gonna speak on until I look at the video. But I wanted to say to you, you did a tremendous job at keeping yourself on a business level that you always presented from day one. I appreciate that. Team Truth members appreciate that. And everybody that probably ever came in contact with you, you um, you always kept it as easy and as peaceful as possible, even straightening somebody. And that's what we appreciate with you, you know, and you try to do this with Shane. I don't know to the extent how y'all, how far it went, but Shane, I want you to understand this. I don't have a problem with you. I never had a problem with you. I move on. It was a learned experience for me. It didn't stop me. It just hurt me because what we did for you or do it for anybody, it wasn't cheap. It wasn't a couple dollars. It wasn't none of that. It was something that could have changed somebody else's life, could have made somebody else's holiday better. So when I when anybody do anything for somebody, somebody do something for me, I appreciate it. That's all we asked for. We didn't ask for your story. 
We didn't ask the, about your, your daughter's situation. Sean called. I answered. When I didn't answer direct, you called the Larry. Larry called me and was on my back when Sean couldn't be on my back to make this happen. And that's how you got in the situation to get into me, where your situation or with your daughter or whatever it was got, got answered. I didn't call you and say, hey, do this. Hey, do that. Hey, tell everybody what I did. I've never been a dude. I've been getting blessed since the age of 12. Blessed through the streets. Blessed through my life. Blessed through the storms. And, I, I uh, don't Angelo, tell you anything. Angelo, Hello? not not to cut you off real quick. Am I, I want to am I breaking this. up? No, no, no. I wanted to address this because Sheena just made a comment. She said, I'm uh, somebody, somebody breaking up. Okay. Um, I don't know if it's me. I'm kind of stationed. It may be you. You're walking around. Okay. But it's, um it's, it's like it's buffing. Oh. Can you hear me clear? I can hear you fine. Okay. So I'm gonna keep talking, but somebody somebody oh, buffing oh. when they talk. Yeah, no, it's me. I'm hold on one second before you okay. begin. Um, Sheena made this comment. She states, I'm a beast. If that was to set me up for disaster, it didn't work. I never was on no crack. I know what I've been through and I know what Larry and them have done to me on this YouTube. Before you address that, let me just say this real quick, Sheena. You missed the point. You really missed the point in everything that was on here. I was not here to attack you, sweetie. This was not a setup. You can't set up somebody you don't know. I don't know you. I don't know your story. I just, uh, uh, Angelo know. Larry just got in the comments and now I think Sean knows. I'm just cut and drop. What, what, what I see, I'm going to address that. I don't do no digging. I don't go any deeper than that, but I, I, just, I just address what's on the surface and you missed it. You missed it. And I don't know what you're talking about. You being a beast and all this stuff like that. Okay. I don't deal with spirits. All right. I, they make me itch. Okay. So let me just tell you this. I'm going to need you to deal with that because my heart was in this. Okay. Because it's my platform. I've never did anything like this. Okay. And um, the thing is, is that you missed it. Because this is nothing about de de uh, destroying you. This was supposed to be uplifting you, allowing you the platform to say, hold on, I did do this. I did say this. Hold on, I didn't do this. Or you know what? I meant it like this. I understood you when you are emotional. But if you want to be accountable, you have to hold yourself accountable. And you went for the wrong people. And I told you that. And I'm going to stay on that. You had the issue with Larry. You should have kept it with Larry. You then made it a Angelo situation, a Sean situation, a Team True situation, and it was a Larry situation. It should have stayed there. So don't then in turn now because you done threw the bombs in this war you created. Say, oh, I'm sorry. Are you missing the arm? Oh, I'm sorry. Are you missing the toe? You got to address everything that you put out there. And here it is what it is. But I just wanted to address that. Angelo, if you wanted to, he taking a shot. We taking shots. <laughs> he had to take a shot. But if you wanted to address this, Sean or uh, Angelo, you're more than welcome to. I'm opening the platform. But I just wanted to address that, girl. You missed it. Okay. Well, I just want to finish real quick what I was saying. Because yep. I'm just going to clear up a lot of things. Okay. That Come. ain't going right. Um, so... What I'm saying is this, like with, with all the women, like I understood, I seen where it was getting sideways and why. Lord, I didn't get please. So they can't hear me. With me. I didn't. Hello. Get because because um, I didn't want her, Shana, to feel like she was being attacked. I don't want somebody to go make right. commentary out of something that can be so um, inspiring and something that can be explained and, and talked out and talked through. So that we can get to a adult, a, a grown folks level. That See, was all this name. messy shit. I have to get away from. It. I have to step away from. It. I got too Mary. much illness around me, and, and too much health oh, no. things oh. going on with me in my own circle. Angelo, so, hold on, because uh -huh. y'all deleting my mon uh, moderators. Look, don't be deleting nobody comments as long as they keep in the queue. We don't boot them out, and especially Larry, if he's stating something that he would like to address, keep it there. Don't delete nothing. Larry, you don't have to delete anything. Uh, if you uh, had a question or whatever the case may be, you could have addressed it. If you want to go live, brother, that's on you. But I'm just letting you know, I'm not, I'm not for that. Go ahead, Angelo. I'm sorry. So, so my thing is, 
my thing is this, right? With everything is uh, I didn't want Sean to get out of character and get on here and give anybody commentary because she's not a YouTuber and Team Troop LLC is not about the YouTube. But if you want it, that YouTube play. That's what Team Truth uh, YouTube was with L rank. That's what that's what L put together. Like I told you, what what Larry platform was? You throw a brick, you throw a rock, he throw a brick. It's simple as that. So she can't feel like she can go at anybody because nobody did anything wrong. Nobody called her. Nobody seeked her. Nobody, you know, looked for. For, for Shana to get anything from her. What she asked for, she got. That's all I'm trying to say. Stop trying to make uh, everything into a negative because that's all y'all live in, a cesspool of negativity. I'm not here to bash her. I didn't speak on her. I didn't speak nothing in her because I don't know her. I did something that was that was documented, receipt, receivable, and I left it as that. She made it safe. I did my due diligence. I reported it back to Sean. I let Laurie know. Boom. To my knowledge, Laurie wanted to get her on and help her out a little further. And should nobody have to be held in a bad light for trying to help you? As simple as that. If you have nothing else to talk about, then that's crazy to me. You run around to get help to, to bash the people to help you. It makes no sense. So whatever she have to do, she have to do. Only thing I wanted to do is tell her that I'm not mad with you. I never was mad with you. I don't think any of us mad with you. We just didn't understand your actions. And I think Sean got on here and restrained herself to the little bit I saw. Well, because I didn't want her to get on here. I don't want her to, to throw stones. I don't want nobody to be on somebody else's platform saying she do this. Oh, oh, she said this and she said that. So that was my purpose of getting, trying to get in, and I had de uh, technical difficulties. But if I wouldn't, I wanted to catch both of them on it to end it on a peaceful note because that's not us. That's not Sean. Sean not to get on here and bash to give people what they want because right. nobody knows who Sean is. Sean is very inspirable, uh, inspiring, mm -hmm. inspiring for people when they get deep with a conversation about their personal life Mm -hmm. I can send them to Sean and they every time I'm talking about 99.9 percent, .9 they going to say, I love this woman. She is excellent. She listens. She do that. And that's what Team Truth LLC represents. If it was different times where we was shutting down the, 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 the YouTube and coming over, then Larry would have been a part, a major part in that Team Truth LLC. But if but we it took on a whole new monster on the internet, so therefore he had to be hit his own entity there, and that's where he fought at. You throw a rock, he throw a brick, period. That that's it. Team Truth LLC is gonna fail, find a way to build a shield, so nobody had to fight and nobody had to worry. That's it. That's it. And I apologize for me. For a lot of things I did out of character, but a lot of people on YouTube forget one thing, that I do have a daughter that caused my whole life, my family life, to completely change off of this situation. So this is not a me on anybody team. This on me getting past Azriel and going to a whole bigger team of life, a whole bigger team of daughters, a whole bigger team of nieces, a whole bigger team of sisters, whole bigger team of mothers and aunts and, and grandmothers, because I've had people my mother age express their situation that they never told nobody. I had young ladies who never spoke married, going through different difficulties and never knew how to tell a husband and this and that. So I don't do this to toot my own home. I do it because I, I are your secret safe with this, with this, and this is how the commitment that I made to people when I opened up a door to say, hey, Higgle Team Truth LLC. That's it. You know, that's all I wanted to get on here and say I'm not for all the, the rest of the, the mess. I mean, messy people got to stay messy people. We're trying to build a nation of kings and queens. And if everybody can't see where the world is going right now and don't see how the need is needed right now, not, not later, not tomorrow, but right now, 
then that's on them. They they are part of the problem. It's about building right now. And if they ain't on the building tip, then they need to just find something else to do with their life, especially when it come to me or coming at me or anything that out there is around me that I love. It's simple as that. So I appreciate you, Whitney, for, you know, extending your platform as always, um, even though we do a lot of talking um, outside of this. I appreciate you always, you know, being being sincere and, and sharing your own situation. And that's what a lot of people don't understand, man. Some of these, a lot of these people that has their own business, their own channels, and their own, it's, they have been a part of something traumatic. And, and, and the world forget that. Oh, you're a blogger, but you act like you don't got feelings. But they know what that woman went through. I don't know what they went through, but you can you can dialogue with it. And that was my point of saying these women on this channel, it's a lot of pain. And it's a lot of pain in the chat because it's a lot of women, a lot of queens in this chat, and a lot of kings that have been, that has that secret. And all we're trying to do is create a place where there's no more secrets, where you could come here and openly talk and get past this shit because it's not your fault. It's not your fault you turned out where you turned out because you didn't get the help. So why should we let another generation be born and not have avenues for them to get the help right away so this don't become the next generation problem? That's all I'm trying to do. That's it. So I appreciate y'all. I love my Team Truth. I love my Team Truth, Team Truth LLC and my Team Truth. So out of respect, man, um, anybody that need to know other things, they, they can hit me up. I'm, I'm open book. Hit me up. You know, um, things with me and Larry and other things are going on. You know, hey, we go through a lot of things. That's life. You know, y'all got figured out. I don't do messy. That's the bottom line. Mm -hmm. And I think a lot of people are the messy. They don't want understanding good dialogue and to grow like all these other channels. Exactly. They want us to be on here like fools and mm -hmm. got to dog each other. We got to punch each other in the eye for entertainment. No, I think that a lot of us are very articulate people that have a brain that they only wish certain people wish they could have to be able to get on here and come together and, and have an enjoyable life and understand and get something out of it. So that's my whole thing. You know, I, I, I ain't get in for certain reason. I'm glad I didn't because I did not want Miss Shana to leave and think she got jumped on. Right. That up, none of that. And I kept texting you that. I said, no, nah, I ain't going to come on because I don't want her to feel like we we didn't we didn't trap the end. No, I ain't want that. I just wanted to tell her that I'm not mad with her. Mm -hmm. Whatever she did on her channel, I have never been on her channel. Not one time. I've never addressed nothing on her channel. I didn't need to. But if you throw a stone over here and keep saying, Larry, mm -hmm. Larry will throw a rock. And it's expected. Everybody knows reputation on YouTube. So what's the difference? Mm -hmm. don't, don't cry if you pick a fight. And don't act like you don't know who hit you. That's the problem I have. Don't act like you don't know who hit you. Larry don't need batteries. He's a grown man. Really? Sean didn't need battery. She a grown woman. Mm -mm. Everybody speak accordingly to how they're affected. If you say something that affects somebody, they're going to react and say something back. That's it. Um, Angelo, Sean has got back on the stream. Uh, here she just is. Fix, fix. Can y'all hear me? Yes, we can. Okay. I can't hear her phone messed up. Okay. Lord. <laughs> I heard all y'all. Thank you, you JoJo. Okay, let me say this, because I'm going to do this with her or without her. I'm not going to apologize for my tone. This woman has let been slandering me, me since let me May. Let me off, because I don't want to be on whatever you have left to say if it ain't a note to say. Leave it as Queens. I think you did a phenomenal job. I don't think you need to let, listen, only my opinion. I do not think you need to suppease anything else on this YouTube. I think you've done a tremendous job. I think when Shana sit back, she's going to think about what you said. And she's going to appreciate you and what you said. That's what I think. On that, I'm out. Peace to all y'all Queens. The Kings ahead, thank y'all. Keep supporting, man. Keep supporting, keep supporting. Whitney, beautiful job. Thank you, Sean. Always. I'll talk to you later. Peace. Okay. Um, I'm just going to, uh, uh, Sean, hold on one second, okay? 
All right, you guys. All right. Those that stayed, I'm very appreciative. Okay. And look, I just want to make this very, very, very clear. It's never been my aim to be messy, to be dramatic. And I actually saw a comment. Somebody said that um, if it was from the heart, you wouldn't have to explain it. Sometimes you do. Okay. Let me tell you why. It was a man in the Bible named Jesus. He had to explain everything. Miracles, when he put people's ears back on, when he curing disease and stuff like that. And people didn't believe that he was all good, even when it was good. And he had to explain himself, okay? So the thing is, is that, you know, the word also says, don't let your good be evil spoken of, all right? So that's why I have to reiterate the, the, the motivation of it all, okay? So I don't think that there's anything wrong with having to put that out there, especially when people are coming in and out of the chat or in and out of this, okay? This platform, all right? Uh, I really do want to wrap this up because I don't want it to go any way left than what it already has because, again, like Brother Angelo said, that's never been my intent. I'm a woman of God, for one, and for two, I'm a black woman, and I will never knock down another woman. And that's why I was trying to get Sheena on here. Sometimes it don't feel good, okay? That's why the word also says that the word of God is a double-edged sword. It hurts going in and out, okay? But you have to hold yourself accountable. And when you get through getting cut and bruised, you got people that love you that'll give you some bandages. OK, and I'm that I'm going to have to hold you accountable. But at the same day, I love my daughter. So I might get on her little cute butt, but I'm going to hold I'm going to bandage her up and pick her up and, and move along the way. OK, but the thing is, is that we is hands out time out. For us to do things also like brother angelo said throw throw stones and then hide your hand no 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 no. you have to deal with what you put out there but then you can't just sit up there and be like well why are they acting this way you did something <laughs> you did something and let's you know hold ourselves accountable and then we'll address the people that did something to you but it's about self-accountability and that's the reason why r kelly got away with a lot of stuff because he had he didn't have that and then the people that were around him were yes men why because they wanted that coin okay so i don't need no coins from y'all <laughs> trust me i'm like this regularly yes my my husband takes care of me okay we're good that's why i don't be on this platform like this okay <laughs> all right let's just clarify that okay so the thing is is that i don't have no intentions my heart is what you're seeing. And it's that, oh, you got an issue? You got an issue? Okay, let's work this out. Let's come to a, even a, even balance with this and let's move forward, okay? So I say all that to say that I leave this with you guys. We don't got time for the BS, all right? We're steady getting distracted by frivolous stuff when our world is literally going to hell, okay? We're literally in the last days and you guys are worrying about who did what where they got this who said that why why do it matter okay so just think about that um and those that are are true believers of god the word says for you not to be easily what offended yeah so if you're getting offended you need to check yourself OK, um, I didn't get offended by uh, Sheena's tone or nothing. I just had to redirect it because I knew where Sean was coming from because I did have a dialect from her. OK, but the thing is, is that we do have to respect each other's life because we have to live once the computer goes down and once we shut this thing down. So um, I was going to bring Sean back on here and we'll have a personal thing. And if depending on what she reveals, um, you know, um, which actually I don't think is really messy. What she wanted to present to you guys was a voicemail. And the voicemail was just stating how, you know, she just wanted to uh, get help, you know? And so she basically wanted to drive her point home with letting you guys know that uh, their intentions were right with helping her, um, you know? And um, I think you guys get that though now, you know? Let me see this post. Um. Okay, Tori, you said, Whitney, I heard her story, and from what I got out of it, a lot of things were, uh, was did behind the scenes. So why do Team Truth point the finger at DJ? He innocent to the situation. I don't know what you're talking about, baby. I don't know if you, I think you just got on here, Tori, because nobody was pointing no fingers at DJ. I didn't even hear his name being brought up, sweetie. I didn't. Now, you probably heard that from Sheena. 
But this, where, where's my where my logo? Over here, right there. Yeah, this is Whitney DTV. I, I didn't mention no DJ. I don't have to mention another platform on my platform. Uh, so I don't know what that said, but yeah, you know. Uh, okay, and then this one says, you need to leave my brother name out of your bull. My brother Robert Sylvester Kelly is good. Stop trying to preach. Speaking ill regarding my brother. Child, let me make this very clear to you. Again, you must start just now getting on her too because I ain't spoke ill of your brother, okay? I actually said that I, we were two point peas in a pod at one point in time about our sexual abuse. So, Ma, I'm gonna need y'all to step it up again, okay? Y'all better go on somewhere, all right? Okay, because this ain't it. This is not it. Keep it cute or get the boo, okay? And your brother, baby, you need to pray for him. You yelling at me with all your caps ain't going to get him out of jail, baby. You yelling at me with all your caps ain't going to make him stop messing with little girls. <laughs> okay? All right. Now, um, let's see. Nisi Mo speaking ill of R. Kelly by saying he needs help. Thank you. People like you are part of the problem. Accountability. Exactly. Okay? Now, if I said it, I will hold myself accountable, okay? But I didn't say, y'all know me, y'all been here. I haven't said anything. I wasn't even speaking this whole time, okay? I So I don't know why you coming on my platform being disrespectful because I wasn't talking about uh, R. Kelly. Um, okay, anybody else got any questions, concerns, and or comments? Uh, Nisi, baby, please get off my platform. All right, sweetie? Because all prayers aren't needed, okay? And I got a, a, a heaping dose of prayer, okay, by people that I know who God they worship, okay? So thank you, but get off my channel, baby, okay? Um, any other questions, concerns, or comments? I'll take them here for the next probably five minutes. And let me see. I'm new to your platform. I just, I was just browsing. Well, hello. Okay, thank you, Mary. Blockiana, I want to see you block down. I want to see you block down. Blockiana, yeah, okay. Enjoy that block party, all right? Um, I would like to join and speak. Okay, Tori, I'm going to allow you the platform, but let's stay on topic, okay? Because I think you're just coming in, and um, I want to allow you the platform. However, uh, you're coming at a way that you're kind of on the end, um, I talked to her personally before I did this interview. So I, I know the story, all of it. But when she got on the platform, it kind of changed because she was dealing with somebody who really, really know her. And so um, it kind of got, you know, misconstrued and stuff kind of got washed away and some stuff got holes and mixed up. And she got confronted. And I can only deal with what is in front of me, okay? But, um, I would I don't mind you coming on the platform, okay? At all. You're more than welcome to. The link is in the description box. Um, but yeah, but let, let this be very clear. I'm not gonna be going back and forth, okay? Because I'm not this wasn't even my my stance. I was just opening my platform for two individuals to settle their uh scarf. And I don't I I'm not quite sure if that went, you know, well. But it is what it is. Y'all grown at the end of the day. Y'all going to choose to do what y'all want to do. Um, any questions, concerns in our comments? But again, was I not fair? Like, tell me, was I not fair? Because, I mean, um, we are praying for you, Nisi, and I hope you get help for your delusion. <laughs> well, okay, we're going to take a little, uh, yes, sir. Okay. Um, and we're going to uh, wrap this up, okay? Because we've been on this mode for three hours. Well, okay. Um, you know, uh, Tori, let me see. I would like to join and speak. Okay. Um, oh, oh, no, I'm not for that. I come respectfully. Okay. You got a couple of minutes. Anybody got the link? Girl, you couldn't have been more fair. Seriously, I, I'm just saying. Anybody got the link? Let me see if I can find it. I got a few minutes. Okay, there it go. Okay, there you go, Tori. There you go, love. Go ahead, click, and I'll allow you the floor. Okay, I got a few minutes, you guys. I'm going to have to get off of here.
All right, Tori. Come on, baby. It says your site can't be reached. Uh, I, I guess it's not, not in the powers that be, baby. That's the link. That's what you saw Sean come through. Uh, if you was on there, you saw um, Angelo. Come on. That's the link, love. I don't know what else to say. Um, I mean, you can, you're more than welcome to reach out to me on my email at reviews with Whitney D at gmail.com. Um, and we can, you know, go converse there. Um, and you know, we can move forward with that. I, I mean, I think Sean wants a part two. I'm going to see, cause y'all don't ran me raggedy. Okay. Uh, this wig is now a uh, green. Okay. Because whew, Lord, but I, like I said, I'm going to wrap this up, but like, I really want to leave with you, uh, leave this with you guys. We need to hold ourselves accountable for real. And, uh, I think we'll be better off in life if we did that, because, um, it's a lot of pointing of fingers and things like that. And we need to stand on what we say and what we do. Okay. Uh, sorry, y'all. Cause Sean is uh, messaging me, but not for nothing. You guys, this is it. I really, really uh, appreciate you guys coming in. Um, take time out to go over to the plug with Retania Sellers. Okay, she is starting her YouTube channel, and you really want to hear some some woman of God, godliness, and and prayers, and purpose, and power. Go check her out and let her know that Whitney D and Whitney D TV sent you as well. Head on over to Three Shots and my wonderful fine husband and his two friends are over there and they shoot the stuff with you guys and give you guys a perspective with men, men, okay? Single, newlywed, and married advice and information. And I'm telling you, it's a good dialect. I'm going to play both of these new people's um. Oh, let's see. You handle it well. Kudos. Thank you. Um, go on and check them out. And while you guys are there, please take the time out to look at all my brand affiliates from Lips and Lashes by Shea Cosmetics to Supernatural Cosmetics, LLC. Yeah, LLC. Everybody LLC in this. Um, as well as uh, Noel and Embrace Pangea. You guys check them out. They're all black owned and affiliates and um yeah, you guys, um, keep it cute. Three shots in. Please subscribe. Thank you, Mary. Right, let me pin that post. Please, please subscribe and don't forget the plug, okay? So I love you guys so very much. And But most of all, Christ love you guys. Be encouraged. We got enough craziness out in this world. Love you guys. Deuces. Hey, what's up with it, man? It's your boy Darren, better known as Super. Woo -hoo. Woo -hoo. Woo -hoo. It's your boy Antonio Maximus. <laughs> Yeah, y'all like the weird new words for one and only big homie, AG. Brown or white, hand or gin. Everybody tell the truth when you're three shots in. in. Lips and Lashes by Shea Cosmetics is way more than its namesake. From primers, mascaras, eyeshadows, foundations, lippies, lashes, and so much more. For that fierce look you can't find anywhere else, Lips and Lashes by Shea Cosmetics. Tell them Whitney from Reviews Whitney D sent you. I'm happy to say that I am a brand ambassador of Noel. Noel is handcrafted, no harsh chemicals, scrubs, oils, soaps, and more. Quality skincare at affordable prices. Check them out and let them know that Whitney D of Whitney D TV sent you by using either my code Whitney30 at checkout or the link in the description box below.
Shazaz Creations is a virtual boutique for creative customized apparel, tumblers, and jewelry. Allow them to create a keepsake that you can use as a heirloom for centuries to come. Everything from blankets to pillows, allow your memories to come alive with every picture. Tell them Whitney D from Whitney D TV sent you. Use the Whitney D code or link in the description box below. Bye. Welcome to Embrace Pangea. These products are all created to bring you back to balance through nature's gifts. They have a wide range of products that deal with various aspects of daily life, such as deodorants, juices, clothing, vagina detoxes, and body scrubs. Whichever product that you decide to embrace, you can rest assured that it was created with love for the betterment of self. Embrace your Pangea. Visit the link in the description box below and let them know that Whitney D of Whitney D TV sent you. Bye. So yeah, so check out the uh, site embracepangea.com and uh, em embrace your Pangea. You know what I'm saying? Thank you for tuning into the show. Now it's your turn. We want to hear from you. But remember, keep it cute or get the boot. Let's talk in the comments down below. Check out all our sponsors and affiliates in the description box. And, and don't forget to join the Witness Nation by clicking the subscribe button. Thank you. Until next time, this is Whitney D with Whitney D TV. Signing off.